So hi guys. We si huku Europe kumechemka. Europe kumechemuka mambo imechemuka huku Europe. So on Saturday or the last uh, weekend, last weekend like the 27 EU countries walikuwa na vote European Union members of parliament. Tuko pamoja. And we are shocked, especially CC immigrants. Tuko hivi. Kwa sababu, we can actually see history repeating itself. Most of us tunasema hivyo, it's like we were here when that history was happening. But hatukua. But tumesikia, tumesoma pia nyinyi wenye hamko kwa hii country. Mumesoma how bad it was back in the days. And it's about to repeat itself again. And uh, reason being, ile chama ina, ina panda sana. Ni awa kwa number two, not only in Germany, but in Europe. France imewa vote vibaya sana pia. Ni chama ambayo iko anti-immigrants. Hmm. Wanasema mtu yote ambayo yako huku illegally, lazima arudi kwa. Sijuka mna kumbuka, a while back I made a video here, ni kasema tunataka kurudisho kwetu. Sasa iyo chama ime panda like crazy. East Germany, by the way, they are actually number one. Wako number one Eastern Germany. Hmm? Hmm? Wako even better than the leading party as we speak. Eh? As we speak. It's called the Alternative Party for Germany, AFD. Hmm? Wame, wame ingia, wame ongoza. Na nilikuwa nasikiza some of the content from international news. Na ona most Germans, or most Europeans are saying that finally Germany has woken up, finally Europe has woken up. Hmm? Uh, they are, they, apparently they want to safeguard their country. It's bad news for, peop for lazy people and criminals because apparently most immigrants are lazy people and criminals. Yeah. Nabald, very, very soon, the regional elections are coming and... With the love that these people have been given, ni naona wakingia. But can you imagine they have the majority seat kwa European Parliament? Yeah? You know what that means. You know what that means, guys. Yeah? Munajui yona manisha nini, but let me tell you one thing. Ni meskia, ni mejaribu kuwaskiza kwa sababu I had to listen to them to find out ni nini yo kitu mzuri ambayo watu wanaskia. Because for us, immigrants, tuko tu pale kwa they are anti-migrants. By the way, they are, they are the party that haitaki Germany support Ukraine, wanataka wa shake hands na Putin, wa, wa try to make peace. Unajua, it's that party there yenye na trying kukua controversial. They just try to do those things. But I've been trying to listen to them. They are like, they are not deporting people who are here legally. They are not deporting people who are not criminals or when you are in a artist, I will because this video is checked. And it might take me hours to upload because Nikki mentioned these words. But I can see on social media so many immigrants are terrified. Nini ngesema hivi, kama wewe uko nyumbani, you're not working, you're depending on the government. It might not be good, but I know one thing for sure. Ata wakingia, let's say they waingie ndani saa hii kwa wenini ya Germany. Hakuna kitu watafanya, wale watu wako hapa watakai. Itakuwa maybe hard for those people who are, who are aspiring to come in, not to get in. But for us who are already here, I don't think it's going to be that easy for them to, to take us back. Since it in make sense. I don't think it's going to be that easy for them to just take us back. Anyways, yeah, let this be an eye-opener for those people who didn't vote. For most of us who have the uh, German papers and had to go and a poll station to vote, let it be an eye-opener. When the regional elections come, let's do it differently. Let's try to do it. But here in Hamburg, I think the Grüne Party is winning. The in Eastern Germany, that's where most people have voted uh, for the for the far right party, which is the alternative party for Germany. But we've always known that that we are not liked. Uko Eastern Germany. But pia nyinyi mekuja kuwana, zile vitu zimekuwa kuhap, ziki happen uku. Recently, mtu alienda 
Wati hivyo mkenya boy child alikuwa ameenda anapiga polisi mangumi na mateke. Huku mtu ametoka na huku hizi country za Waislamu sasa ku mention akaenda akapiga polisi hadi huyo polisi akamuua. Akauua huyo polisi sikia nikisema hadi huyo polisi akamuua. Hii macho ina shake. Nasikia ni deficiency ya mag magnesium. So, na the, palikuwa na polisi wengi. So, mimi nilikuwa najiulizaji. Mbona hawa watu hawa shoot na kaa ingekuwa mtu mweusi angekuwa shabsh. Eh? Sasa ndio nilikuwa nauliza Karo Bestie yangu akaniambia, "Hawa shootingi kwa sababu they get a lot of paperwork. You have to do a lot of paperwork kuandika why you you did that blah blah blah. Huku you're not supposed to just atishi mtu." We, well, anyways, updates, updates kidogo. Sawa so, tani wa update story ya uh, the new Germany embassy rules in Nairobi. Na I, I, I'll also share my own opinion on the chance mkate. Na hapa, by the way, hapa kuna mtu waliniambia ati I invented that chance mkate. Ati hakuna kitu kama iyo. Hakuna venye Germany neza itikisha watu kuja wafanya kazi. So I was like, he he he, Ruth. Eh, na watu wanananga ni kiwa msmati hivo jamini. I can just sit down and think of something. They decide what I'm going to say to my because they are so stupid. They can't do their own research. I was so mad at that comment. But I was so mad at that comment. But I was so mad I was so mad at that comment. But I was so mad at that comment. These people who are always coming to attack. Every time I see such thing, I'm like, breathe in, breathe out, Ruth. It's just one of them. One of the haters, so I let it pass. Nime nime squeeze nime learn to react to to things differently. Anyways, before I bala bala bala, I shana ah, I give you a lot of moshanganga. Let's forward the video to the next part. Kuna changes zili happen towards the end of last month. The the German embassy in Nairobi. Na I just wanted to update you. I know it's been like two weeks, almost two weeks. After hiyo changes ili happen. Nika sema maybe kuna watu wengine bado wa wajona. Why not update you? Kitambo ukitaka kuja, ukitaka kuja Germany with a long term visa. With a visa valid for more than 90 days. Lazima ungeenda Germany embassy. Siku hizi, siyo lazima uende embassy. Wanasema if you want to apply for a visa which is valid for more than 90 days. Uneza enda kwa TLS contact. TLS contact and it's like an agency. Hmm? So do you wanna say my submission of applications in these categories will be will then only be possible at TLS contact and no longer at the Germany Embassy in Nairobi. Why is the receipt of application outsourced to TLS contact? By outsourcing the application receipt process, there will There will no longer be any waiting times for appointments for the applic application categories mentioned. The German Embassy Nairobi will also free up capacity to process higher numbers of applicants. Simnona, as in it's it's made easier. It has been made easier. Where is the visa application center located, and where is it? When is it open? EOT LS contact the address of the visa. Application center is as follows: fourth floor, nine West Building, Ring Road, Parklands, Westlands, Nairobi, Kenya. Visa applications can be submitted to TLS contacts between 8:30 and 2:30 p.m. Monday to Friday, excluding public holiday. Na hizi public holiday siza nini peke yake? Siza Kenya peke yake. Hadi za Germany una juu sasa zingine Kenya mna zako amuna holiday. But uku Germany ni holiday so ina apply kwa German embassy pia. How can I book an appointment with TLS contact to submit my visa application? Hapo eh, kwa website wamekwambia kwenye unaweza book. You can book the appointment on the TLS contact website. They have their own website. Does TLS contact charge a fee for accepting visa application? Yes. The service fee is 20 euros, 50, uh, 20 euros and 50 cent. Guys. Kitambo visa ilikuwa 75 euros which was more than 10,000 Kenya shillings. So 28 euros and 50 cent hiyo ni gesheng, hiyo ni gift. And the 28 euros and 50 cent should be converted into Kenya shillings. In additional TLS contact offers 
for a fee to make photocopies. So if you go there and your documents are not enough, you're going to get a uh, you you will be able to make copies, biometric pictures, send passport by courier, and inform applicant via SMS when the passport is ready for collection. So for a fee, unapata those extra services. With the Germany Embassy Nairobi continue to process visa applications yes tls contact only accept the application and then send them to the germany embassy nairobi where the applications are processed and decided upon the the, the, the good thing is akuna interview akuna kushinda ukiuliza mtu unaenda uko fire nini unarudi nini so your documents are going to speak for you so if you are wale ile category watu wenye wanaandika motivation letter that motivation letter is going to be everything that motivation letter ndio itakusimamia hmm? na supporting documents hapa kuna interview sa zingine watu wanakuanga wa nervous unakuwa unaogopa ogopa so ukienda hizi my interview the, the thought of going for that interview itself inapatia watu pressure where can i find the information sheet for the outsourced application category The information sheet can be found both on the website of the Germany Embassy Nairobi and on the website of the external service provider here in your TLS contact. Where do I have to habitually reside in order to submit an application to TLS contact? If you reside in Kenya, Somalia, Eritrea, Burundi, Sudan or Seychelles, then the Germany Embassy Nairobi is responsible for processing your national visa application you can then submit your application for one of the applications category mentioned to TLS contact and you take up to any information you go to the germany embassy page you get to know everything you get to know everything so kuna story ya chance and cut in iliongelea juzi and i feel like it's a very 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 good opportunity and i was thinking eh yeah, Uba yangu nikisha nikishaanza ku research sa kitu I don't stop thinking. I was thinking. So kuna hii point wanasema you don't have to have the German language for you to come here. Meaning they waambia tu hivi. If you know the career or your professional, your profession does not need the German language, then you're good to go. But if your career, you know when you come here you're going to be working with people. You're going to be talking a lot with the germans themselves or with the natives then you need the german language so if you are planning to come or you you want to apply for that chance and card start learning the german language as up mm? start learning the german language as soon as possible because why come here we use your 11000 which is one point something money and then at the end of the year you don't even have that uh, full time job because you cannot be able to speak the language because you cannot be able to interact with the people why i love another thing i was thinking there are so many companies that are looking for people so maybe if they are not ready to employ you like fully like they are not sure if you're good enough when you're doing those online interviews maybe you can ask them just give me a part time job with a limited contract maybe a contract of six months let me come there and then you 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 watch me like mtu anasema ngaji when ukuje huku waku waangalie kazi yako ukiwa huku even if they give you that contract of those 20 hours you'll be able to you utakuwa hapa already and you don't need the blocked account and we have so many people with other companies if you can be able if you are allowed to work in other jobs then why not then why not look for a, a, a job because so many people are complaining about the 11000 their blocked account the money but there are so many other things you can do there are so many people who are looking for especially kazi za mikono lakini kama wewe ni mtu wa maringo i don't think this one is going to work for you If you can get those hizo kazi zenye watu wengi hawapendi za hoteli za hospitali za huko za mjengo za carpentry all those jobs as you look for that other job that you want I think it's going to be good enough and it's going to save you that that uh, hassle of having a blocked account Anyways German haipendi wavivu na haipendi watu wanachakuwa kazi so wewe kama unataka kukuja hapa alafu hutaki kuchoka 
itakuwa ngumu itakuwa ngumu unless eh, unless eh, you have that cost that kila mtu anatafuta utakuza kama umepata job <coughs> anyways na uh, mimi wapenda sana na jana tulichaguana na nimesikia the chama that we were trying to vote out imesonga haijashinda lakini imesonga it's coming up so people seems to like it watu wanaipenda na yeah lakini pia sisi wale watu huku za huku we end up doing things hata mimi mwenyewe i'm like hmm, maybe tuna deserve hata sisi kupelekwa nyumbani kwa sababu tell me why mtu atakuja Kenya si hata naonanga wa Kenya wakiteta venye wanaijaa wamejaa huko mtu atakuja Kenya alafu aanze kuua watu kuua mapolisi ku, kufanya vitu zingine mbaya sera nyinyi mtasema huyo mtu aende kwao arudi kwao ama arudishwe so hata saa zingine hata mimi naona they have the right to do so alafu kuna watu huku kwa hii channel yetu wana complain ati naongea Kiswahili sana bethe ni mzoea sasa hata ngisti komu siku sawa kijerumani anyways thank you so much na kama mnaelewa more about this new new uh, TLS thing kindly let me know bye bye